on guys today in this video I'm gonna be doing a what's on my iPhone video because um, why not so let's get started so as you can see I've just got all the stock apps messages calendar photos camera blah 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 so then down in the bottom I've got I fix it like so I can get guides on how to fix my phone or something Instagram Facebook Twitter messenger and mail I'm sure you know what those social medias do. If you don't, well, I don't know. But so I've got mail, like, just get all my mail and stuff. So then if we go over to the next page, I have got, I have got 105 apps, so it might take a while. So we've got this first folder. It's just got Apple Store, WWDC, Find My iPhone, Keynote, GarageBand Numbers, Pages, iMovie, iCloud Drive, Remote, and News. So the most used app here is probably the remote. I use it for like the Apple TV because the remote goes missing a lot. So moving on to the next page, we've got games. So I've got Sunday Lawn, Angry Birds, Logo Quiz, Angry Birds, Seasons, Jetpack, Jetpack, um, Jetpack Joyride, Where's My Water, Fruit Ninja, Subway Surf, and Color Switch. My favorite one out of here is probably Logo Quiz because I don't know, it's like, it's interesting sometimes. Right now, going on to games too. I know some of you are probably going to be like, well, Ryan, why don't you just like put it all in the same games folder? Well, I just like them separate, so that's what I'm going to do. So I've got Angry Birds, GTA 3, Ice Stunt 2, Piano Tiles 2, Smurfs, Ninja Fishing, Ski Safari, and Stack. And what have we got? Oh, we've got Piano Tiles, Happy Wheels, and Colouring on this page. Yeah, the colour in for like my brother and sister to play on my phone, so I don't really use that. But favourite one here is probably Stack. It's a nice, simple game, and I like it. Now, moving on to the Google page. Now, again, you're probably going to be like, well, you've got Apple. Like, why do you use Google stuff? Well, Google is good, and I like Google. So, we've got Google+. Plus. Chrome Remote Desktop, Chrome, Gmail, Google Docs, Google Sheets, AdSense, Google Authenticator, My Business, Translate, Google Maps, and Google. I just like download everything because I can, but use Remote Desktop so like when I'm not home, I can use my computer. Maybe if I'm downloading something and I'm not home, I can see how it's going and stuff. Um, I don't really use anything else. I don't really use Google Chrome. I use Google Maps sometimes, but... Most of the time, I just use, like, the regular maps. All right, so moving on to the useful utilities folder. We've got Wemo, Hippo Live, Live Traffic, Cheats for GTA, Instashare, Serves New South Wales, and QR Reader. So the Live Traffic in New South Wales thing, I just I don't use that. It's just there for – it's just there. Um, Wemo, so, like, I can turn my lamp on when I'm not near it, out of the house or something. Hippo lights, like, so I can control the cursor on my Mac if, like, it's connected to the Apple TV and the computer's, like, next to it or something. I can use that. Um, Instashare, you can, like, transfer photos from an, from an iDevice to an iDevice, so, like, iPad to iPhone, iPad to iPad, anything like that. All right, so now going on to the cool one. So I've got Thing. Things to like check the Wi-Fi so I can see who's on the network. Bit strips like you can make little comics when you, you log in with Facebook. IKEA store. Well, that's used sometimes. And we've got Telstra Air because Telstra Air gives me free Wi-Fi. So, yay. Um, Musical.ly. You can add me on there. I'm at Ryan Phillips 10. I suck at them. So, no, don't like yeah, I don't need to get told. So we've got TV Guide, so I can see what's going on. Um, layout for Instagram, it's like pic collage or something like that where you can put all the pictures together and look cool. Live.ly, it's for Musical.ly and you can live stream. Snapchat, at Ryan Phillips 03. Yeah, all right, so now I've got the video one. This is probably the most used area. So we've got YouTube. Well, you're watching this on YouTube right now. So there you go. Vivo to watch like the music videos. 
YouTube studio so I can like see how the videos are going people's comments I can reply to them um, Netflix to watch movies plus seven to catch up on TV that has aired on channel seven Google Photos I back up all my photos to Google Photos so they're in two places just in case something happens YouTube gaming it's like a new app I'm pretty sure I, I haven't used it but I heard it's pretty good YouTube kids for my brother and sister to use so they don't like click on stuff they shouldn't. We've got music and shop. Half of this is just all mixed up. So we've got FaceTime. Well, you video call people. Skype, same thing. Kogan.com, it's like a website in Australia that you can like buy stuff from cheap. Musify. Um, I don't use that, so I could probably get rid of that. Um, Daily Hip, I got that, you download that off the app store and then in Daily Hip I downloaded this app, iTuner, you can just like download free music, so I could do a tutorial maybe, right, I've got eBay to buy stuff, mwave.com.au to buy stuff, um, now I've got the random, we've got <coughs> wiki camps for like I don't know if I go away <clears throat> and Shazam so if there's a song playing and you'd like that song and you don't know what it's called if you Shazam it well there you go you're not the song's called I've got Twitch to watch people live stream Gumtree to buy stuff Facebook pages manager to like see how my Facebook pages are going have a look at Mac OS Sierra that's like a page I made We've got OneDrive and car sales. Now, obviously, I don't have a car, so it's just there because, because it's just there. Now, finance, there's PayPal, speed test, and AI remote. Now, none of those have to do with finance except for PayPal, but speed test, you test your internet, and AI remote's like for a HP printer, I could print stuff from my phone. All right, now we're going to, well, oh, we've got, we, we missed one. We missed this one. So we've got Spotify to play music, Tuning Radio to play music, Hoyts and Event Cinemas. They're movies. So I can, like, if I want to go to the movies, just, just have a look, see what's on. All right, now let's go to Xbox. We've got Xbox 360 and Xbox One Smart Glass. You can control your console from the phone, which I find that pretty cool, so I like that. Then we've got fuel. Obviously, I don't have a car, but I just have it. 7-Eleven, Woolworths, Coles Express, and Caltex. Just don't ask me why. They're just there. All right, so now we've got the awesome category. So the if this, then that, and then do button, and Evernote. I, if this, then that, it's like you can, like the Wemo. I have it so every night time it comes on, and I get a notification on my phone how the weather's going to be in the day. Evernote, so I'm pretty sure it's like a Microsoft Note thing. And then we've got iFruit for Grand Theft Auto 5 to connect to it. You can, like, do stuff. Um, Australia Post, so if I'm getting something sent to me, put the tracking number in and see how far it is away. And Boomerang, something for Instagram. I haven't used that. Now, just there, yeah, I've got some... I've got some stuff here. I've got, I don't know what that is on the left, but I've here is the pre-installed app. So that's basically all that's on my phone. So I think I'm going to end this video here. So thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, all that stuff. Let me know in the comments what like you want me to do and stuff like that. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.